Hey, what's going on everybody? How's it going? John here with another video. Hope you guys are doing well today. Keeping the vibrations way up high the roof to the sky. So I just wanna I just wanna talk about today my experience yesterday with my first meditation retreat, which was an all-day thing. It was from I had to get up like real I had to get up like six o'clock in the morning and i get ready fast anyways i had i set my alarm but i just woke up automatically because my body sensed that i was going with this but i just woke up really early because it was like a little over an hour drive and it was at some i think people still live there but they leave it for people to hold like retreats and stuff so we had a meditation retreat it was called Revive Your Soul. And it's also the same meditation instructors I've been going to on Sunday mornings. Well, every other Sunday. But the retreat was from 7.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. Let me tell you, it was, I, it was a... I'll, I'll say it's a life-changing experience. Powerful experience. Like, literally, you'll learn a lot. You'll meet, there, like, there are so many open-minded people. I'm guessing there's, like, about 20 people there. Like, it was, it's really nice meeting people like-minded, but also open-minded that are, because it looked like if there are some people that are new to this, and it's like those people show up because they're interested, they're open-minded. And I just like meeting people like that or just being with, around people like that. It's just like a place where no one literally judges you. Like if you tell your story or like energy healing, energy cleansing, it's just like no one, no one judges. It's like everyone's open-minded no judgment or anything but it was really amazing like what do we cover we did like there's this instructor i think she was one of the main ones that held it she was like in her spiritual dress type uniform and she had like the sage with her or that incense like the little thing and like at the beginning because it was it was pretty chilly that in the morning because the sun was like coming up and we had the fire around and it, it, I'm telling you it was there was a bunch of nature everywhere everywhere that's like man that would be amazing to live at a place like that like I'm telling you, you had the view of the Chesapeake Bay because it was along the Chesapeake Bay and there was just so much nature everywhere the view they had bald eagle uh, they had we saw the bald eagle like from like a distance and bald eagles are symbolism and spirituality i believe that and they said they had like dolphins in the water which i didn't see any but but in the beginning we had the fire in the fire pit and we were just sitting along there that's where they were doing like she had all the incense and like she went around like cleansing us, getting all that energy no longer needed out of us. And then we just did a bunch of like talking and just introducing ourselves. We did, got like we did a meditation, chakra activation meditation, powerful experience. And I'm telling you, that's what, that's the video I made the other day. Just being out in nature, just being in the sun, literally can just activate your chakras once you put your energy towards it and do your inner work. And what else did we do? We just did a bunch of talking, basically all the stuff that I've learned on my own that, like creating your own reality, uh, like you're the creator, like you're the creator. You have the ability to create what you want or in the now moment. Like 
you are not your emotions. Like, instead of reacting, feel and experience your emotions and your thoughts. Like, some, like cause and effect type thing. And just learning how you... Like, since you're the creator of the moment, literally, you can take the situation in a different way instead of reacting to it. Like, with anger, you can just take it another way. Like, handle it a different way or a better way. Because you have the ability to create that now moment situation. And they just taught us a bunch of that. Uh, what else? Oh, organic smoothies. They taught, they, they showed us, they use a blender and they, mi they mix smoothies like with carrots, lettuce, bananas, strawberries all together, beet juice. And they, like, it was organic. And they were, we had to drink, we drank smoothies, which literally can be your lunch. That literally fills you up. I want to. I really want to start making smoothies now. And that was that was so delicious. We had an organic lunch, and they were explaining like how toxic foods and fluoride water is, like how it gives you diseases. Like when you eat like too much fast food or just junk food, like all that negative energy. Like they have in a GMO type crap. Literally going in your body and just giving you diseases. And from like companies and all that. And literally how they don't like how it's organic food. How that's less, ex how GMO food is more expensive than organic food. They were talking about all that stuff, and I'm like, wow. I mean, I've already known that, but it's just like, the universe literally brought me to this school. It was just amazing, and what else did we do? Yeah, we had break time, getting to know people, and I'm trying to think. We had the letting go ceremony at the very end. Like, they gave us a rope. And you get to tie your knots on, like, which stuff you want to let go. And, like, it can be anything that's holding you back. And we got some sage, and we threw the rope and the sage in the fire pit. And we did, like, a little <clears throat> ancestral ancestral ceremony like I think it had to do with like your spirit animal or something like with the sun also the water gods and all and we did like little mini prayers sing along about like doing that using the say and she was like blowing the her little horn thing or that little chauffeur, chauffeur thing like it was really amazing And yeah, we did like a little sing-along. Like it was in Spanish, but it was in, like it was about like the Lord of the Fire, Lord of the Waters, all that. Like, it was wow. And after I left there, and I also got a protection bracelet. I mean, I left it at the house, but I don't have it on now. I need to put it on, but I'm telling y'all, if you ever want to go on a meditation retreat, I'm telling you, it's definitely worth it. You will learn a lot. It will change you. It will help you grow and progress. And when they do like letting go ceremonies, like you will feel like weights being lifted off of you. Like old version of your versions of yourself like literally being taken away like literally the universe was looking out for me because I thought I wasn't going to be able to go for a second because I thought I was I thought I paid late or something or that I wasn't going to be able to go because of I don't know 
I just had a feeling that I wasn't going to be able to go, like, something was holding me back, but I was like, something opened that door for me, and I was meant to go to that, you know? And just meeting so many like-minded, open-minded people. Not just like-minded, but just also open-minded people that are just willing to, like, listen and learn. Like, no judgment, nothing. It's just like, wow. This is great to meet amazing, high-vibrational people like that. Oh, and we did we did do a bunch of, like, breath work. And we had to lay down for that, because if you do it, like, if you do all those breath works, like, sitting up, you could, like, feel lightheaded. And... I literally dozed off a little, like, when we were doing that, and other people did, of course, and they said that was the point of it, because you're so relaxed, you're so grounded, you're so in the moment, because it was, man, they might have another one next month, I'm probably, I'll, I'll probably definitely go to that again, it's definitely worth it, life-changing. I'd like to go to an international one, like, where they, like, go around the, like, go to, like, a different country or something, na nature-wise. I would definitely want to go to that. Like, literally. But they'll keep us updated, and I'll keep you guys updated. But, yeah, I just want to tell you guys my experience with that. Like I said, if you guys ever interested interested in going to like a meditation retreat do it it is worth it you guys will enjoy yourselves it will change your life even if you're new to this it will definitely change your life and they were also explaining like what we're going through now like the, with the collective like the ascension they mentioned the around december last year with the energy like new beginnings like what's going on around this world and people waking up like relationships and all because we are in that time of new beginnings and the old ways falling away and people just waking up but yeah just want to tell you guys my experience and i'll talk to you guys later bye